Welcome back to more Minecraft. I don't know why I switched this to this. This is the wrong screen. Uh, hi. Hello. Hello. I've got my coffee. Hello. So, uh, hell, oh, nice, Izzy. Uh, so I've got, uh, I got my, uh, my PC panel mini installed. Um, and it's working quite well. I'm going to be resetting all my defaults, my audio defaults in Discord. So I can use the PC panel to adjust the, dis the Discord volume. So maybe, uh, when Space Pickle mumbles, I'll still be able to hear him. That's the hope. Right now, though, for some reason, I'm getting a ton of crackling in this ear, and uh, it's acting like it, the headphones are completely discharged, which is fantastic. So he only mumbles on your side. Right, so that's what I'm saying. If I reset all the defaults and use this to adjust the volume, I'm hoping you and he will come through at about the same volume, especially when he mumbles. You see, what, you see what I'm saying, Izzy? Because he's mumbled in person. The man, the man, the man mumbles. He, he mumbles, and my desk is atrocious. And I'm trying to put a cord away, and it's not being cooperative. I should have done that before I hit stream. But pew pew, who cares? Anyway, uh, I had a visit from Mr. Random Number Generator himself because he was in the area. Uh, and he says, so your computer cords are treating you like the rest of us. Yes. Yes, they are. Uh, that was good times. We had, you know, lots of talky-talky. It was, it was good times. Um. Yeah. I'm, I'm, uh, I feel like I've been pushing off, uh, not quite a headache, but I felt like, it feels like there's like a headache just waiting. Just waiting for its chance to leap into my brain meats. Ow. <laughs> Ow. And now I've gone and given it the opportunity. Uh, yeah, it's good so, but hopefully the storm system coming in is probably havoc with your head. Yeah, Izzy, that's probably the same thing. Um, all the snow melted, uh, just in time for tomorrow to be a winter storm warning. And I'm driving tomorrow into the Ann Arbor area, so that'll be fun. So yeah, it'll be good times. Uh, we'll have plenty of exciting driving waiting for us on Sunday, I'm sure. Exciting, serve like that Chinese curse, may you live in interesting times. Yes, Sunday, Sunday. You, you almost forgot, don't be me. Don't be me, I'm excited. I want this furniture to, to sort of finish up doing the the, the living, well, not finish up. I still have to get a TV mount. But, but anyway, um, good thing it's on your calendar. It will alert you. Yes, that is good. That is good. All right, let's, uh, let's play a game. And are the, are the bops, are the bops too loud or are they at a good volume? I don't want to play the game. Well, you're in the game, Izzy, so... No, I can't make you. You join the game yourself. What is happening right now? Oh, it's nighttime. Izzy, it's nighttime. We should probably go to sleep. Oh, you're, you are sleeping. All right, well, I'm going to get to a bed. Hold on. I should go to sleep. You're right, Izzy. You're absolutely right. Gonna do that right now. Uh, we t we discussed server options uh, for the future of the Minecraft server, like what kind of stuff uh, he was thinking about doing and and how to how to administer it, and a couple of Linux questions. And yeah, it it looks like it's all gonna be pretty freaking doable. I should eat some carrots. Ooh, waffles. Hi, waffles. How are you today? Oh, I've got a lot of stuff on me. I was going to. Why do I have paper? 
I was going to the uh, the pagoda area to drop off stuff, if I remember correctly. Why even do I have this paper? Um, why the door? I don't know. Let's leave the door here, though. I think I need the door. Uh, let's bring the extra torches. It's fine. Uh, I'm okay. Chest pain from anxiety. Otherwise, I'm great. Oh, I hate when that happens. Hates it, precious. We we three are are our anxiety. We're anxiety pals. <laughs> Wobbles, you, me, and Izzy are anxiety pals. There are there are absolutely no dues or homework or or any extra work involved with being anxiety pals because you already have too much because you're an anxiety pal that's how anxiety pals work <laughs> so i have to look at some of this rail because i'm the idea of having the glass in the way is growing on me. I know I didn't do this a lot of this fancier stuff in my later tunnels. Yeah, server is much faster now. Server is much faster now uh, after the upgrade. That is so much glass. I have yeah, I have several. The 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 northern route is fine. It's it's pretty much got it, but. This route is like this. Oh, no, that would really take away a lot of the space. You know what I mean? Hmm. Maybe not. Maybe not. We'll see. If I put a, like a slab in front of the fire to prevent, you know, fire interaction, I guess, it would still wouldn't see. The, the thing is, on the other, where there's glass in the way, I don't have to go and relight things that have been either put out by mobs or by players swinging at mobs, namely me. So, yeah, there's just the two of us on right now. So it's pretty fast. Um, Space Pickle, I'm once again watching without volume. What's the skipper working on today? <laughs> No audio, so this is... Hold on. Stay... No. No steak on a tray. I'm not crying about glass, Izzy. I'm not crying about it. I'm trying to think about how I should do it. Wow. Dry tears. You made like eight stacks. I have so much glass though. I don't need any more glass. I could probably do the whole rail like if I wanted to uh, with glass. But the way that the tunnels, I, I designed these, Peter and I designed these tunnels. I don't know that that's really even necessary. If I made, I mean forced my town hall to make it up. <laughs> nice. Nice. Uh, totally. Izzy, you're not helping. That's not... You need to look up the word, Izzy. So I'm guessing Space Pickle, uh, his daughter, since he said his daughter took a nap, he's, uh, he's actually, yeah, waiting with her to act for her to fall asleep. In this case, I am not recommending percussive maintenance. See this, I could use, I could use glass here, I guess. But it's unnecessary because it's set back. 
I define that word. My picture is right next to that definition. Maybe the sarcastic definition, but it's there. No, Izzy. No, it's freaking not. No. No. Uh, the doorbell woes continue. It's not there. No. No. The doorbell woes continue, by the way. Mm, by the way. No, my front door isn't a ding-a-ling. No. Uh, yeah, it's the screw. So I got the tiny-ass screws. I got the screws that they said... It's not the right ones. Here they are. I, I don't know if you can even see how tiny these screws are. Those screws are too big. The, the, the screw part of the screw is too big, and they're angled when they should be flat. So they're the wrong screw. I need to contact ADT, the security company, and ask them to, uh, to get me replacement screws for the back of the unit, I think. And I'm gonna let them do the work. Uh, since their installer is the one who did it wrong. So, also, yeah, 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 yeah. And then I get to try it once that works, once I can do that. Well, actually, Peter suggested today a way for me to start tracing, uh, the lines from the, from the doorbell. So I should be able to, to to basically short them out, make them have a contact to short them out, and I should be able to use my multimeter to detect that. Uh, that's the plan anyway, that's the hope. Hopes and dreams, you know what I'm saying? Hopes and dreams. Uh, so hopefully I'll be able to track down where the where the wires come out while I'm getting while I'm while ADT is getting me the right screw. Yeah, from the random number generator of all people. Yeah, he came up with the idea today. I was like, I was gonna have to go buy an expensive line toner, and uh, which you affix to one end of a wire, and then you the other end senses the current coming from that, and then it detects it as an audio tone. So you follow, you could follow it in the walls. Sometimes, sometimes you have to actually get it very close to the wire itself. But uh, it's used when you're running ethernet cable and running phone cable. Salazar, absolutely more mi more Minecrafting, absolutely. And and honestly, more chit-chatting as, as the, we go down the rail and bring uh, supplies back and forth that for some reason, I... I put somewhere bad or silly. I don't know. I did a lot of stuff. Um, Space Pickle says, remember the like 20 stacks of buttons I made for my nether fortress by my base? I put them all down and decided it was a bad place for spawning, so that was a few hours of dumbness. Oh, no! And he wasn't even drunk. Wait, who wasn't drunk? Uh, oh, the random number generator. No, he wasn't drunk. Me? No, I wasn't drunk either. Man, I'd, I'd like to be right now, though. I haven't had any alcohol in the house for quite some time. Not that that's a bad thing. Zeb says, I'm barely still up. I get to catch some skip for J-Stream. You do, Zeb. Hello. Welcome. As he says, the drunk part is when you misplace supplies. No, I just... I. So I had them with me from building the pagoda here. I had them with me from building this. And then I went and did something else and decided to drop it off. Oh my God, Izzy. All right, let's see what we can do this here, here. What else? What have we already got that we can, no, no, nothing. Okay. Well, we're gonna put that in here then. We got paper, spruce fence, more spruce fence. Slabity slabs, trap doors, barrels, stripped logs. <laughs> That, uh, let's put this over here. Let's make some more sense here. Why did I even have the shears? I don't recall. Uh, 
You have you have almost a whole box of jungle logs. Nice. Where did is he really? Is he? Is he? I have allergies. <laughs> yes, it's very pretty, but I have allergies. <laughs> Get in the bed, Izzy. <laughs> I did. I did. Jeez. Some people, you know, guys, you know? All right, I've got this here. That's fine. Uh, and it was shulker box. Yeah, dirt and axes and more lilacs. Uh... All right, so let's go. We got one more run of stuff to go, so supplies, and there's hardly any, but it's it was more than I could carry at the time. So let's go get that other run. I don't know if we'll come back to working on this today. I am inspired again by how pretty it looks. And there's like four more levels to build. Uh, so yeah. Um, Zeb, I am continually impressed inspired me to go look for ideas for yourself. Nice, Izzy. Uh, Zeb, I'm continually impressed by your streaming lately, and I have been having a very good time watching it. So, you know, it's been fun. I have been having a good time. Guys, if you do... Oh, you know what? You know what? Hold on, I can do this. I haven't done this in a while. There you go. I get to shout out Zeb. He's doing good things. Over there in the Twitch dare. This one. Uh, he's been playing a lot of Monster Hunter Rise. They're going to be putting up a Valheim server, I hear. Uh, so that's happening. Uh, yep, yeah, Izzy's yay Valheim! Izzy is a big fan of Valheim and she's a ridiculously good builder. Um, Izzy, you should check out, uh, who, this is a video I watched on Valheim by, uh, Let's Game It Out, is the name of the YouTube channel. And they, um, they're, they're, his, his goal is to break the game and to, yeah, probably the tornado. Yes, the tornado one. Yeah, but I thought the tornado one was in. I thought the tor no, the tornado one is, is his. Yeah, okay, you know the guy. Okay, he did a Valheim, one or two Valheim streams, and they are amazing. Oh, he did it in Valheim and Raft. He also did it in. He did it first, I think, in Satisfactory. Uh. Yeah, and if he gets more than two frames a second, he's not satisfied with what he's built. So, you've seen the video that I'm talking about then. That's excellent. Um, good, good. I thought of that. I saw that. I immediately thought of you and Dreos. Immediately. <laughs> uh, also, I thought of you guys again today because uh, I started... Uh, so I told you guys I started looking for some people, just, you know, testing the waters for new friends and uh, and stuff locally through some apps. You know, those those dating type apps. And uh, I started talking today with somebody over in, uh, over in Windsor, which was hilarious. I didn't realize they were in Windsor until after I started talking to them, but it's just a, it gives you a circle, you know, of distance that you set. And of course, Windsor's not that far away. <sighs> so, uh, yeah. Just chitty chatting. Nothing, nothing big. Uh, so yeah. It's, it's, uh, we'll, we'll see. We'll see. Uh, so far, uh, I, I expressed my excitement about, uh, building, uh, and having a compost again and building a new compost bin out of scrap wood and their their response was oh you have to let me help that sounds like so much fun so <laughs> uh so so you know that i don't often expect the things that i consider fun 
to be fun for others. But then, <laughs> uh, I've been socialized to think that, that I was, anyway, anyway. Have I seen the rest of us? I haven't because I don't have HBO Plus or whatever it is. Uh, and I don't think I'd subscribe for it now after the, what they did to DC. And I haven't played the video game. Us. Oh, not the Last of Us show. You mean our group of friends. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I just, it was, it's so rare to, to come upon people like us. Or it has been, at least in my experience, that I, uh, I don't expect it to happen often. So... Uh-oh, Zalicer did some boost into the toots. Uh, sir, sir? You're, sir, are you, is your name Space Pickle? Because you're on the rails. I would, I would, I would stab you for that, but you've got two friends here. And I, uh, I'm gonna, bye now, goodbye. Get off my rail. Yep, that zombie piglin was dancing on the rails. It does like the music. Is the music at a good volume, you guys? Is it good? Because I've got, I'm actually not using the, um, the amp for once. You like it, okay, I see. I'm using my, PC panel mini. Dun, dun, dun. Not a sponsored stream. It's too quiet for Space Pickle because he has his volume turned all the way down, is he? Because he has his volume turned all the way down for the child. For the child. You feel his pain for, because of his, his child? I'm so confused. Oh, been there, done that. Yes, yes. Yeah, same. Same, same. Same, same. You're terrified of the midday nap, and then when it happens, well, there goes any sleep I was going to get that night. <laughs> I can't even remember which kids. There was like one of them, maybe, that, that didn't happen to? I think maybe it was. Uh, maybe it was Ace. I'm not entirely sure. Not entirely sure. I, oh, Ace has got a surgery coming up on her finger this month. Hopefully, her doctor doesn't reschedule at the last minute again. So, uh. Zeltzer says, oh, I'm doing a canning thing this weekend. Nice, Zeltzer. I have such a busy weekend. Oh, my lord. Chicken stock. Actually, yeah, you did that before. You're, uh, you're, you're ready to do another batch of chicken stock, huh? Is it canning when you're putting them in jars? Do you think that would be called jarring? It seems, it seems, it seems pretty jarring to me. <laughs> it's a very jarring weekend. That's right, Izzy. That reminds me, I need to text my dad to find out uh, where and when he wants to meet up on uh, on Friday. And I need to ask Ace tomorrow which house she wants to keep her bike at. Her new bike that she got from her grandparents for the holidays. It's called canning because that's what they used originally. Yeah, I, I agree with that, but also quit it. <laughs> because my pun worked real well, Zalicer, until you brought facts into the picture and now it's all broken. <laughs> like half of politics you know it works great you're all faxed up now what captain buzzkill yes Alistair, that's what i'm saying you're captain buzz that's what they call me yep 
more puns. All right, I don't think that Peter's watching, but uh, I'm actually gonna pick up this stuff and then I'm gonna show you guys uh, what I did in his basement. <laughs> Also, Space Pickle, I informed uh, the random one, as we should now call him forever after. Uh, this, I don't want it there, but I also don't want it. Let's put it here. Okay. Um, I actually thought my dip, deep, deep dish pizza opinion would get me canceled today. Is out, sir? I could tell you were trolling. And being a jerk face on purpose, and I was already done. And go fuck yourself, Alistair. <laughs> pizza is pizza. There's no reason to be exclusionary or fucking elitist about fucking pizza. It's some bullshit. That's what's getting me mad. I don't care about who likes what pizza, but to tell someone that their pizza isn't pizza is asinine. Absolutely asinine and made me angry. So, oh, you can see some of them up there growing. Izzy wants to sleep right now? Jesus, so needy. I'm in bed. Jeez. All right. Let's uh let's take this rail upwards and onwards. Yeah, the scary coaster indeed. You can see along the scary coaster, I have perhaps added some certain vines that are already growing quite well. No, I don't need you to. What? What? No. No. Wait. Oh, it hit that one. There it is. Uh oh, now I've, I've activated his cart system. I can hear them going now. Oops, I can't go that way. Oh, there it goes! We're gonna go out on the scary rail on the other side. They are possessed. No, they just got pushed. Jeez, Izzy. Come on now. You know how this works. Anyway, you can see that I have uh, been generous with my uh, planting near the rail here. He's random enough they're possessed. All right, that's fair. Some of it, as you can see, some of it grows really fast. Some of it grows pretty slow. I don't know where this one's gonna take me, but we'll find out. Is he gonna, no, we're gonna loop around. Okay, I, I did do a couple over here too. Round and round she goes. Where she stops, nobody knows. Oh, he really did take the dirt blocks out from under the trees. What a jerk face. See, he was even gonna expand over there and then dig down again. Peter likes to diggy dig hole. All right, now we go down. Shortly after I started, when I was a real noob, I took the rail. I got very afeard of what mobs I found, yeah. All right, now we're, we're just gonna start over. Okay, how about I get out of the rail? And then you slow down, because this is not gonna go anywhere. Okay. Oh, almost lost it. But yeah, this one I think I took the, the, the bulbs off of to plant others. There is one on the floor level. One what? Rail. Yeah, I know. That's the one I started with. There's a bunch of rail on the floor level. In fact, it goes behind a bunch of walls. 
he was using rail quite a bit when he was when he was digging out the basement I mean hence all of this rail that's the wrong one you took the scenic tour at basement level nice do you remember this the slimes Cause there used to be slimes that would uh, spawn in there quite a bit all right there's the other things I need to drop off uh, that would have been hilarious if you had jumped after the minecart. <laughs> yeah, would have. That's what stopped my mini car at the time. Or your minecart at the time. Wow, the slimes. Yeah, because when you kill one, it splits into four more. And when you kill the mid-sized ones, each of those splits into two or three more. Good news is that they, they, you can get a lot of XP doing that. Bad news is it can be a lot of mobs. When you're a noob, they're scary. Indeed, they are. In deedly do their neighbor. Back into the nether. Oh, I love how fast this spawns now. I'm going to sit there waiting for three minutes for the world to spawn anymore. It's so good. Uh, also good news. Uh... You check the updated rail to Skytown? I think so, but I will uh, after we drop this stuff off because I do want to show off Skytown again. Uh, and I don't believe I showed off the finished state of it. Uh, you guys may also notice that YouTube videos have started to go live again because I caught off on my slacking there. But uh, another thing that the, uh, that the random one has said, Senior Random Face, that uh, is that he, uh, he has decided on which mapper to use next i couldn't remember it if you like twisted my elbow or i just i have no recollection of it but um but yeah so the mapper he knows what mapper he wants to use and he's uh he's designing uh the system that it's all gonna run on around to give enough room for that to function properly is he says, considering random conversations with him, I wouldn't remember either. You know, eventually you just get used to, to hopping topics every three seconds, and then, and it's not normal for me, but I just, I just, you know, let myself hop, hop topics, not hot topic, that's a good store, but no, hop topics as much as he does, and it all works out in the end. to do some measurements too before we go to the Ikea's on Sunday I need to make sure that I'm getting the right doohickey thingamabobs that I need uh, also Zalicer thank you for the retoots and the, uh, the boosting of the toots I appreciate that uh, yeah so the um I want to make sure I get the same uh, uh, double shelving unit to, for that sort of split entertainment center look that I'm going for. You're a rootin' tootin' kind of guy, Zalicer. That's fair enough. Um, and uh, I want to make sure that I have the tallest of my old VCR cases. Because, you know, the like the special edition Disney VHS ones that are taller than all the others. So that I can make sure that when I buy a shelving unit... I want it to, to, I want the space to be able to top out just above that, you know, and have enough shelves to, to do that all the way up. Because I like my visual media in hard copy, but that sounds sensible, Gasp! How dare I? Uh-oh, these, these jerks are back, or they never left. I see you guys. I'm, I'm gonna need to just gonna need you to get. Thank you. No, get off of the rail. I don't care if you're dancing, zombie man. Get off my rail. I'm out. <laughs> uh, also.
Also, I, uh, I fixed a PC for Paul. So I'll be getting that back to him soon. I need to confab with my brother on the uh, upcoming birthday gift for my dad. So that'll be cool. He says he wants to go big this year. So I'm like, uh oh. So, so I it says I fixed two clocks this week. Apparently I'm a menace to clocks. I read that. And also, yes, perhaps you are. <laughs> or maybe it's just sock monkey clocks. <coughs> Pardon me. Perhaps it's just the sock monkey clocks. And everything else, not a menace at all. Uh, I got... Uh, I don't know if I told you, Izzy, that uh, I got uh, finally got a, a knob for my uh, dining room uh, dim li dimmer light. That didn't have the knob on it. Uh, I got I got a nice one from Etsy, from the Wren. I put that on almost immediately. Yeah, it is cool. It looks like um, no, it's black. It looks like an old um, like an old stove knob, but smaller. Initially, when I got it and put it on, I'm like, mm, that seems a little too small. I might have regerts. And then I turned off the light and noticed that it, that, that socket has one of those glowy orange lights behind it I'm like no it's perfect because even though the knob is opaque you can still vaguely see the orange uh, light sort of around it so that you you know where to go and, and turn on the light so it ended up being the actual perfect size but congrats on fixing the clocks you decimated Talisir it's good to be able it feels good to be able to do that Oh, pardon me. Uh, unfortunately, I had to reboot the computer before stream because the so software for the PC panel had gotten so hard locked it did didn't even show up in the task manager. <laughs> Salazar says, yes, what I create, I can also destroy. Yeah, I sometimes feel that way about my children. One downside of this weekend is that it is their mom's weekend. I don't, don't get to see him, but I get to see him tomorrow. Skippy taking things to a dark place since 1977. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, it, that also does give me the space to fill my weekend with things, which I have absolutely done. My weekend is chock full. Yep, that was the year I was born. Tell so, sir, every I have been taking things to the dark place literally since the moment I was born. I was in an ICU for a little bit too because I was under I was uh, preemie and and quite a bit underweight, if you can believe it. Though I did make up for it in spades. Ah, here we are. We've made it. We've made the journey. And then we're going to go back so that we can go see uh, go see uh, Skytown again. I told I told the random one, Senior Rando, uh, about Skytown and he gave me the bit most confused look ever. It was glorious. He has no idea how that happened. Uh, Salister says, I was slightly premature as well. Two weeks, jaundiced, and had a massive ear infection. Wow. Is this, is this competition? Is that what this is? <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, so funny. Um, that's, a, that's a jungle sign. I also have a spruce sign and a warped sign. Let's do this and put the signs together. It's a sign. And then put these guys in there and then, oh, no, nope, not the sticks. I want to keep the sticks. I do want to get rid of the dark oak fencing though. 
So it was a bit, a bit touch to go for a bit. Yep, yep. I could call you a young whippersnapper because I am older by a whole year. Yes, you can. Yes, you can. That means Treos is older than you, I think, Zalasar. Because Treos is older than me by, I think, two years. Cow, I swear to God. Freaking cows. 1975. Yeah, he's got me by two years. Cranky. Cranky is probably older, yes. But Cranky. I mean, he's cranky. Which is, I guess, how that works. Uh, cranky, I think, either turned 50 or 51 last year. Yeah, that would make him older. So those those shelf clips I got for the shelves downstairs in the basement, the old the old school shelves, these these bad boys right here, uh, I tested them and they work perfectly. They are exactly what I needed, and Ace Hardware of all places had them. Cre Kegel tracks all the 50-ish people. I mean, he did track more people if he came over to Glimmit. No, I'm just kidding. Uh. <laughs> By the way, you may know, I don't know if it shows up for you guys, but you may notice that my username uh, uh, is green now. Is that, does it show up as green on, uh, if you guys like scroll down right below chat or whatever, or right below the stream or whatever? It is green, yes! It says community champion because I am a member of the Glimish community team now. I have been inducted into the halls of trying to fix problems officially. So, I it's it's I keep telling them they've made a grievous mistake. <laughs> but they don't believe me. So, there you go. As he says fixing stuff is now a hobby as well as a job. It's not a job. I mean, I'm volunteering. So, that sounds like responsibility, hell no. Uh, to quote, to quote, uh, uh, Paco, what's your day job? My day job is kicking servers until they behave in the cloud, is he? Um, but to quote Paco, who heads up the, the team, fixing, yes, I like to fix things. It's what I like to do. I can't fix people, but I like to fix things. Uh, he was like, okay, look. This is, you're already doing the job. All we're doing is giving you the title and access to more knowledge. That's it, you're already doing the job. I was like, okay, not a problem. It's, I don't mind it. You guys are super busy, so I don't, I don't mind it. And they are, they are incredibly busy. Because they're all volunteers as well. And, uh, you know, with as, as, as much of a, a streaming home as I've found on Glimish, it just makes sense to, to, you know, get a little bit more involved. So that's what I'm doing. And it's it makes me pretty happy. I mean, I... I, I guess I guess I'm explaining this well enough. I think I'm explaining this well enough. Oh man, what else has gone on this week? This week's been weird. Um, as well as you can. Thanks, Izzy. Thanks. Uh, I haven't made any more progress on getting uh, traditionally Windows run games running on on Linux yet. I have. I don't know if I said this, I, uh, I told you guys before, I got, uh, oh my, you're as bad as Space Pickle. Um, after dealing with Microsoft logins and then they're them forcing to use the pin, their pin system now when you're using the Microsoft store, uh, uh, 
monkey was like, so, I mean, can we use Linux? And I said, you know, maybe? So I, uh, I got Roblox working under Linux. Working well under Linux with Wine, the new version of Wine after all the help that it's gotten from, uh, from Steam. And with the Proton thing that they did, it's, it runs great. So the next thing to do is, uh, is the Epic Game Store stuff and their easy anti-cheat software Let's see if I can get that running under Linux because if I can get Fortnite and Dead by Daylight running under Linux I think I'm going to be golden uh, and that's that's two Windows machines converted over to Linux Mint that's what I'd run because that's what I uh, I find very easy to maintain uh, if I can do that and not deal with Windows nonsense anymore I mean, we know Java Minecraft works great on Linux. Uh, they wouldn't have access to Bedrock without. There's a couple of workarounds, uh, depending on, on if as long as the project is still maintained. Um, basically, you you install Pocket Edition, the Android version of Pocket Edition, under under Linux in, in, inside a wrapper, and not a not like a not like a like a, a, a musician rapper but like a WRAPPR it's it's it encloses the program and, and and makes it believe it's running on Android uh and as long as that's updated the, be the bedrock works inside of that quite well no not vanilla ice absolutely not vanilla ice no no uh so that's that's the next step, and I'm using my uh, my XPS my Dell XPS laptop, which is running Linux Mint already, as uh, as a test case. Oh, and I get a, I got another laptop coming my way uh, to try to fix from an, uh, another friend who's like uh, I can't get this to power on. Makes no sense. Skippy try to fix it. I said, all right, I'll try to fix it. All right, we're going to Amethystville, no, slash Narf Manor, slash Mountain Home. Oh, that's sneaky up there. The Space Pickle has to finish once he gets back online one day. When the universe c collapses into, or uh, experiences heat death and his daughter finally goes to sleep. I haven't seen any updates to chat since Alistair, by the way, so I don't know. Okay, so we've got the the wonderful new. Oh, is that and that's on a glowstone too. That's beautiful. And I click the button. Exit to Amethystville. Push button to Sky Town. Here we go to Sky Town. See this half. These slabs might do the job. Oh God! Why did that hurt? Is he? And we have plenty of, so I think you can't, you cannot put a cart directly next to flame. It doesn't look like it was, that's so weird. It doesn't do it every time. It's acting like I'm getting dunked into one of these flames. It's the corner, oh, it's up here? Oh yeah. Here, you have, because you have the track right next to open flame. That, that hurts. That, that's what's doing it. All right, so let's go through. Oh wait, deep slate. Oh, just like I did on the other side, Izzy. Well done. I love it. It's a little detail that makes it. So this was a broken nether portal and I fixed it. Half, half slabs the whole room, nice. The piglins kept spawning, I bet they did. Look at this, this one's already all the way down. Look at this. Yep, so again, just like Skytown, this, this portal is hovering. But this is, 
So the, the village spawned up way up high and so did the broken nether portal. So I fixed the nether portal. You can see I used some, some deep slate tile stairs there. And I, uh, I feel like I actually might need to, yeah, I need to put some more slabs on this side. It's a lot, I didn't finish it looks like. Good to know. Um, but I, uh, I mimicked, so it was like to here that was left. And then, so what I did, I just copied the other side almost exactly. I left a little bit of asymmetry. Uh, and we could go through those, right? Like you can go, yeah, you can go right through those. And then this is, this is Sky Town. She's pretty much finished it up. There is so much of this, this, uh, under the tree nonsense going on here. It's amazing. You put a lot of these four, what are these four by four spruces? You can see what in the world is with that building. Izzy, have your kids been building stone, uh, cobblestone buildings again? What happened there? That looks 100% like something your kids would build. Yeah. 100%. Why is there a trader llama up here? Just parked to the fence. But yeah, she added dirt, flattened it out, added some trees, connected all the things. I connected the uh, the nether portal area, which she redid the connection later as she expanded the island. Which you can see in the videos that are coming out soon, This the rest of this week. You can tell when it gets over into a desert biome because the grass goes from darker to lighter. I think you could tell. Anywho, I love it. I absolutely love it. And I don't know if I've recently shown off uh, Amethyst Ville or the, or the tower. So let's do this. I also kind of like this, the rail. Because, uh, it's, it's very much a, 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 an actual rail station vibe where the uh, the rail is a, is a half tile down You had to move the vine What vine Originally it was in the way of the button. Oh That'll do yeah fair enough Then you could just get out here, get your cart. I I, I need to, to change like all of the nether rail stops to this this switching setup so that you don't have to get out of your freaking cart. It's so good. Oh, you did the same thing here too. Amethystville, Wizard Tower, Narf Manor, and Rail to Library. It is it is a cool setup. I like it. Also, it appeals to my late. Oh, you did it on the ceiling too, Izzy. Yes, yes. The detail, yes. And I don't have to jump up into the portal anymore. Only one llama, so technically it's a llama. Uh, so that's not how llamas work, Salazar, okay. So this is the wizard tower. And you see the rails go off to the right and the left to different places. Uh, one of the rails goes to the library eventually. Uh, I think it's that one. I don't know. Uh, I see you've also brought out more more uh, glow glow fruit thingies there to go with the vines climbing up the side of the building. The building to the east is the kids call Cattail Inn. This one over here. The cobble and glass one? Nice. Nice. Uh, also, on, I don't remember which floor it is, but one of these rails should also lead to... The garden is theirs too. One of these rails also leads to Narf Manor, right? The one... Yeah, I'm sure your signs say it. 
Uh, Narf Manor and Kids Village is this way, and then Mountain Home and the Unstable Stable is, and, and the library is this way, I think. Yeah, I think this is the li yeah, this is the library route. And the speakeasy. That's right. The speakeasy. I'd forgotten about the speak. Well, you know what Space Pickle would say in this moment? Oh, Cattail Barton is this way. Yeah, Space Pickle says, what about the signs? Fun fact, the collective noun for a, for a llama is called a flock. I don't think that's true. I didn't even realize you could just plant banners like this on the ground. I'm concerned. I have concerns. That's some pigs. Youngest loves water. Gotcha. All right, we got respect the inn with clean manners, but have a wonderful time at the Cattail Inn. Uh, these pigs are not very clean. Also, I, I, I they're the pig is hogging the the signing book, hogging it. Yeah, they have a pig problem. I'd say so. What did I just pick up? An egg. Okay. Staff only. P.S. Don't raid in or face the consequences. Oh, no! There's more pigs! Ugh. Push through the pigs. Sauna room. Okay. It's in here. It's a chicken room with a bed. Can't wait to show the kids the video of your visit. Nice. That's a nice little room. Chicken white! Stop following me! I oh, got pig! What's this room? It's another bedroom. Oh, two master beds. Oh, you got a table and a chair and friggin' chickens! <clears throat> Get out of the way, pigs. Get out of the way, pigs. All right, here we go. Whew, I feel I feel cleansed of the pigs. Safe house. Is this house safe from the pig? I went the wrong way. I don't think that's the way to the safe house. Maybe? How, what? What? How do I? It says safe house. Oh, is there... oh, there's a door. Okay. Game. Oh, it won't let me. I'm not targeting the door. I'm targeting the stuff in front of it. Okay. Now I can get in there. Well, sure is safe. What's over there? What, well, I see another door. Is this like trial by berries? That does not look good. That doesn't look good. Ow, son of a crap. Ow. Oh, there's nothing here. It's just, it's a berry farm. It's a berry field. <clears throat> and I fell for it. Yeah, berry garden. I fell for it. Okay, everything's fine. What's over here? I have my sword at the ready this time. Wait, okay. That's black felt, that's black wool. <clears throat> um, gee, criminy. But what in the what? Is it a diving board? Oh, it's a... S oh, it's, I see, over there, I see. Water slide and probably a diving board. Yeah, I got the, so you gotta go over here. I'm sure I'll have to sleep soon, but I could also just ignore Izzy and that would also be fine. Um, so I guess I go up here, no? How do I get onto this slide? Wouldn't be the first time, you're not wrong. Okay, okay. Is this, 
Is this... It goes up. Is this it? I think this is it. It's a tripwire thing. It's very random. Well, yeah. It's kids. Is this it? There's the diving board. Where's the dang water sl Oh, it's here. Okay. <laughs> All right, maybe I should put a put a bed down. Wait, what? Okay. That pig almost got me. You see that? The pig tried to come and t t kill me in my sleep. Freaking pigs. I will get you. You get. I will turn you into bacon. Bacon is delicious. Well. Oh, yeah. Uh oh. Uh, uh oh. What's down here? All the things. Okay. Endless fun, right? It's that's right. Okay, okay, we got we're going all right, and then this doesn't look bad. This is fine. We're sploosh. All right, let's. <laughs> uh, all right, all right, we did that. Let's go check out bees. Portats. So many portats. I don't know if you can tell how much Izzy likes purple. So we got the hives with the smokings going on beneath them. Got three hive boxes here. Are they all full? Izzy, come on, get your honey out of there. Cr she's criminy. Get a couple more hive boxes going on, you know? Jeez. Uh, what's in here? There's not even any honey in here. What are you, what are you doing? <laughs> yes, yes, Elster, just like that. It's, oh wait, it's me. He's. Hey, Rick and Morty has been uncanceled, I think. Well, I think they've been recast. I think the, the jackass that uh, that was a sex pest that voiced uh, Rick. I don't know if he also voiced Morty, but he voiced Rick. He's apparently no longer with the show and no longer with uh, Cartoon Network. So that's great. This is, this is Amethystville. Why? And everything is very well organized and leveled completely up. But wait, there's more. We got a bit of an automated farm going on over here. And we have a whole second level down below. That's some librarians. Oh, he voiced both. Okay, yeah, from what I hear that he's being recast. This is a bed spot for the sleep-ins. Are you guys hearing any crackling in the sound? Or is it just my, my right headphone? More sleepins. Just your head. That's great. Thanks, Izzy. Sounds fine here. Excellent. That's good to know. So yeah, this place is freaking huge, Mr. Bigglesworth. Uh, this was a much smaller village in Kent. Hi, Treos. So this is a much smaller village encampment when Izzy got here and she uh, upgraded the ever-loving bejesus out of it. This is That's the old village where these villagers originated from way back before Izzy was even on the server. I, I'm pretty sure none of that is, is upgrade problems, All of that all of that is creeper related. It needed some love and upgrading. You're not wrong. It certainly did. Yes, applaud for I'm here. Now, that's, they weren't that's not what, okay, Treos. <laughs> Hi, Treos, are you moist today? Is 
the second floor of the uh, the entrance. And there is a basement. Right down here. F you cat. Which is huge and awesome. Oh, Jesus. I'm triggering switches and I didn't mean to. Down here. I'm opening up secrets. All the secrets. No, downstairs. Oh, that was the auto bamboo farm. Okay. One day, this will be a secret, and Izzy will have a doorway hidden behind this, this painting. Tomorrow, you likely will be. That's right. That is right, Treos, with the winter storm coming through. I don't know. Flights may be completely grounded tomorrow, so we'll see. I am going to show off the library because I'm very proud of the library, and it's been a while since I've been there. So I'm going to show off the library. No, the library is not moist, but hey, Space Pickle, does that mean you can hear us? Yes. Now, this isn't even expected to be as bad as the last storm. Oh, uh, here we've got winter storm warnings up the up the yin yang. So I'm, I intend to have quite a bit of fun driving tomorrow. Where am I? What is even, what am I doing? Okay, this way. I think it's this way. Uh, abs, uh, Ann Arbor school canceled, including your daycare. Oh no. We'll see if, uh, if Dexter follows suit, I may end up uh, hanging out with the kids for more than I thought. We wanna go far button to the library. Libraries are cool. That's right, Space Pickle. Also, this tunnel is cool that Izzy did. It's a very cool tunnel. It's like the it's like the DTW tunnel underground. The D Detroit at the DTW airport. Space Pickle, you missed so much. I just, I really can't go over it all again, you know? Trio says, 10 inches of snow, oh, Space Pickle, join the game. 10 inches of snow according to the male meteorologist, but it's actually only three to six inches expected. Dang. Dang, Treos. That's rough. Oh, I added pillars a while back to this rail. Support pillars. I'm wondering what Waffle said oh man about earlier. I don't even recall, that was a while back. I do so much enjoy the fog. Uh, uh, the way things phase in with the fog. Oh, here we go. We're gonna see the, there it is, there's the library with the creeper glass. Thank you, Izzy. I did, did I tell you I finished the, the, the basement bookshelves as well? I think I finished them. No, I still need more. I need to head back to a, to a village. I forgot, I thought I'd finished. Because, so I've got, these sides are finished. And these sides are finished. And we've got sleeping quarters down here for everyone, including a clock that I think was gifted by Space Pickle. Uh, but yeah, there's meant to be two little towers of bookshelves here. Hit Old New Bastardam for cheap bookshelves? Yeah, that's probably a good idea. You can always go to the other stronghold I found directly south of Peter's place. Multiple libraries. That's true. I'm gonna raid the stronghold. But yeah, so this there's the, uh, the two-story uh, uh, glass panes that look like uh, creepers. Looks like a creeper face. It's 
Nice outdoor reading spot. You'd like to study there? Yeah, I think it's a nice place, Space Pickle. I would agree. Nice weather, open air, flowing through, great ambiance. Though, like many of my buildings, and this one wasn't, I didn't build this building, I renovated this into the library. But there's, I see the trolls have been up here. I'm not sure what to do with uh, the top two floors yet. Like many of the things that I have built. This is all the stuff from building and there's so much of everything. <clears throat> and the stairway continues upward into an attic. It's technically open. All right, let's head back down to the beds so that Izzy and Space Pickle don't complain when it's time to sleep. Yeah, I had a fun time making this. I found one online and I, I took that as sort of a, I didn't take it as a prescriptivist like this. You do it exactly this way. I just sort of, I did a lot of it very similarly, but not, uh, not exactly the same. Unlike the uh, Pagoda, which I'm doing like to the block the same way. But yeah, this one was built into this, the house and the, the balcony was not even, which initially destroyed me. Oh wow, that's a lot of trees planted right there. Um, you can see I added, the library has its own set, uh, its own colors and set of, uh, of flags of um, banners because I didn't want to claim it as mine because number one, I didn't build it. I just renovated it. And number two, and then, you know, did a lot of terraforming out here. And number two, it's meant to be public. It's for everyone to use. So I didn't want to claim it as my own. So I gave it its own banners which you can also see in here how do we use it i mean it's a library space pickle there's no in-game use for it but why are you like this i mean you can use these books rpg night right i mean it's very, I, I do, I do still, I'm, I'm a little proud of, of doing this as well in the nether brick. If only I'd had deep slate at the time. <sighs> this basement didn't exist, by the way. There was like a bed that you had to fall down a thing to get to. And it was not easy to get back out. So this whole basement and tunnel was, I dug. So can't we make the new bookshelves or are those for the next update? What new bookshelves? The custom, I didn't, I don't know Space Pickle. I've not heard of this. Custom bookshelves that you could put books in. That would be great for the library. But I had not heard of this amazing thing of which you speak. They show up to six books on the front. Any kind of books you want. Wow. Neat. Bye, library. Yeah, that was all gravel. It was just gravel. But yeah, you guys can see I made uh, I made stand uh, supports of various sizes for the rail. <clears throat> I am excited to start building with uh, deep slate to add another sort to add a, a bit of shade. A little bit of not sameness to a lot of my builds because it, it works so much like stone brick but is darker then you can tile it so good it's a nice view of the countryside when you're on this rail and then BAM
So Space Pickle, the real tunnel is fair. It is fun, is he? Space Pickle, with this PC panel that I am going now, I'm going to be um, resetting all my Discord audio levels. So hopefully uh, your mumbling won't, uh, won't be so uh, problematic in the future. Yeah, I got it, and I've set it up. That's I'm now can, and also I can leave my headphones plugged into the PC, press the volume knob like a button, and it switches uh, between speakers and my headphones. What about your mumbling? I don't mumble. I'm too loud. I'm not. I'm not quiet. Just go watch the uh, the Hot Wing Challenge from 2020 to find out how loud I am. I'm just gonna take these bookshelves. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> so let's go. Let's go back. Let's go downstairs. I will fight you. <laughs> I bet you will, Izzy. Let's go back to the Nether portal and go over to where Peter's place is. And uh, you will win. You think so? You think so? Uh, and. Uh, so wait, now if I want to use this to go out that way, I have to place my cart there so that I have the forward momentum to start, right? Yes, okay. Oh man, excuse me. You press the button, right, but it doesn't, it matters where the cart is placed because gravity is what gets you going in which direction. If, you, if I had placed it on the other side and pressed the button, I would go the other direction. That's what I'm trying to say. Sure, but you don't have to push forward. I never pushed forward before. I just put make sure that it's partially in the block and then the desire, the then the, uh, the block exiting the other the the cart exiting the block gives it the momentum i didn't i don't have to push anything thank you for the party fish sal sir so we'll come out in the pyramid then we'll head to uh to peter's place again wait Oh, well, yeah, we'll head to the front of Peter's place to see if we can find this place that Space Pickle has found. Yeah, this will work. Party Parrot! I wonder if these buttons up here are stone or wood, because if they're stone, I need to replace them with wood, because wood buttons stay pressed longer than stone ones do. You can't type today. I mean, that happens, Salisir. That happens. They are, in fact, wood. Okay, good. Good, good, good. If I remember correctly, Space Pillar, you said in front of his house? Is that correct? South. I'm facing west. Oh, south is this, so the glass. You should look at the map you posted. I don't think that I will. Can't read that stuff. Oh, hey, look. This looks familiar. We were there earlier. Is it over? That's true. Is it over by the um, by the turtle eggs? It's significantly so. So I have to get in the water. Jesus! I thought you said it was by Peters. This—that's not by Peters. You bet, you bet you thought that. Listen, I just need you to pick up some more of these turtle eggs and then make a soup out of them. All right. You have some with you, nice. So 
So I need to keep going south, huh? Is that what you're saying? Is there some sort of marker that I could be looking out for? That's what all the cool kids are doing. I made a big building. Well, look at this. We're going under the bridge. He could have just said this way. Give it away, give it away. Am I still heading south? Am I still heading south? Yes, I'm still facing south. Or my orchard over there on the right. I needed what, five or six more bookshelves? Yeah, this certainly is oh, quite a way south. There's, there's some land. Are we there? I don't know. Maybe. He says there's a big building. He built a big building on top of it. So. <sighs> Luckily, I brought a bed with me. But I can't tell you. All I know is it's directly south. Fair enough. Okay. Now well, let's go to sleep. Under the stars. Next time, take a tent. Wow. Wow. Okay, facing south. Okay, good. <coughs> And now we run south. There's a mushroom. Bunch of mushrooms. What is that, a jungle biome right there? That's interesting. This is once again, wait, which channel was this? This was eh, hype bangers on pretzel. You built on the water's edge, but I can't tell you if you're far enough. Fair enough. Pretty sure I've stayed south direct, almost directly south facing. So. Do you remember the mushrooms? And the jungle trees. I don't remember where in relation. That's fine. Oh, almost fell down that one. Oh, see now dodging the trees is gonna put me offline. There's more water. Looked at map, looks like past mushrooms. Okay. Get on my way, squid! This is a one hell of a trip for books. I could have just gone to Bastardam. What is that? That looks like a building. What is that? Stone pillars, not a building. Yeah, you can have, but this is fun. That's not it. But what is it? I keep going straight south. All right. Nineteen flea just followed the stream. Thank you for that follow, flea. I appreciate it. Welcome to stream and our nonsense.
where I'm trying to find the spot the space pickle found that I'm not even sure exists. Oh, hey, there it is. <laughs> That's a pretty building, space pickle. That looks nice. You're welcome. It's like end hotel part do. Is this, was this for safety? Is that why? Oh dear. Leia, sure. There's, you're saying there's no real reason, aren't you? Just, you just did it because it was cool. I see you, Space Pickle. All right, let's go down here. And to be seen. Yeah, that makes sense. Oh my God, I'm making myself dizzy. Holy shnikes. Just chilling out in Minecraft, having a good time. There are more than one entrance to the end. Yeah, apparently, I didn't know. Apparently, there are a, a punch, a, bu a punch, a bunch. We're just uh, checking out stuff on our ancient Minecraft server that's been around for 10 years plus. Oh, there's copper. So this is a newly spawned one. Oh, we're, and we're down into the deep slate. Punch crazy? No, I wouldn't mind a cup of punch though. Man, it gets deep. Here we are. So yeah, we're just chilling in Minecraft and Flea, how you doing? You just left this here. Was that Lapis? You're in deep now, that's right. Uh, which way am I supposed to go though? For the library? I guess it doesn't matter. The thing to know is that the stairs head into the stronghold proper, but the reverse heads straight to the portal. Oh. Let's just do this. Yeah, there's the portal. Which, of course, you opened. Where's your bed? <laughs> oh, you didn't use it. Okay. But does that end up going to the same spot in the end that the other ender portal does? The other end portal does? Okay. The center, okay. I'm good on this way. I will event, I'm sure I'll totally be able to find my, out, my way out without any difficulty. So I'm gonna use my pickaxe because it has, uh, <clears throat> has uh, uh, silk touch on it. Otherwise these will just break apart into books. Oh, and then there's more tunnel over here. Hi, zombie. Hi, lava. Got it. No, thank you. Let's, uh. Oh, hey, look. These ones are just sort of hovering here. Are you kidding me right now? Zombie coming. Thanks, Izzy. Thanks, Izzy. Oh, no, that didn't, it, oh, I dropped the one. Where'd the other one go? Vital and time, oh, it's up there. Vital and timely info indeed. Let's just get the floating ones. Just, just like that, that town. Oh, spider, oh, spider webs. So that should be six. Yeah, that's enough. What's up here? More books! Different exit? No, not really. Benny, you're floating. Go home. Nice. I was about to say, you're just gonna ignore that zombie? Yeah, I was gonna completely ignore that zombie, but the zombie didn't give me the chance. All right, now I gotta try to remember how to get out. Which I'm pretty sure I'm already going in the wrong direction. Which, you know, is fine. I guess. <laughs> 
Use your, hi Mosier. I could use my pickaxe, but uh, Space Pickle already dug a way out of here. I just have to find where that was. That's not it. That's not it either. That's just tough and gold. Use your map. I don't have a map. Treos, you're the worst. Make a map. Oh my god. I found it, okay? I found it. Without a map. Wonders will never cease. <laughs> I am going to end up giving it and installing that map mod, that, that local mini map mod, because it would seem so useful. And to be able to pin locations seems so useful. So that thing you're doing, do the opposite of that. Hashtag helpful advice. <clears throat> Izzy, I know, I, I know you're using it and Space Pickle's using it. And I should really start it. Since it's just a client side mod, you know, it's not, it doesn't have to touch the server. Need more coffee. Uh, you should install an elevator. Thanks, Trey. It's not my spot. <sighs> Your face touches the server. <laughs> Wouldn't you like to know, uh, Mosher? That's pretty much the motto of the stream. Yeah. What, what was the What was the phrase? Doing the right things, the going about the right things all the wrong way. Yeah. That's our motto, all right. TMI. <laughs> so I should be facing north now. No, I need to. I'm facing east. I need to face north to go back. Uh east north no go that oh god oh lord i don't want to there we go oh no it's getting to be night so since i'm not going to have land uh after a little while i'm going to go ahead and park here and we'll put our bed down right here stay right there don't move procure your face yes that is the definition of obstinate I don't know what you mean though I'm not obstinate at all what ha I'm sleeping now so I don't want to jinx it but I noticed that we haven't had any disconnects or drop frames. So I think that whatever was going on on the back end of Glimish is resolved. But man, the web RT stu RTC stuff that they're building, oof, so nice. Oh, you just jinxed yourself? Yeah, probably, Zalicer. It's kind of a way of life for me, though. Really? You're just gonna... Water, don't you steal my friggin' boat. This is my boat. It's Pretzel Rocks hooked up to your Twitch stream. It's very... Yes. It's probably posting song titles and credits there. That's my guess. Why, Mosier? Why do you ask? Oh, it absolutely is. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Did you not notice that Mosier was here, Izzy? I mean, I, I said, I said hello to Mosier. Did you just, were you just not paying attention or? Let me in the boat. Taking a page out of your book. Oh, that's dangerous. That is not recommended. You assume that she listens to you. I have conf what the hell? That's deep. I have pretty I have confirmation that she listens to me because she yells at me when I say things. <laughs> You're not wrong. <laughs> Did 
<laughs> she does, yeah, I bet she does, Treos. Funny thing is, it hasn't stopped me from saying things. You know, it's it's all a little it's a little weird like that. Just <laughs> I still say things all the all the damn time. Come on, dolphin! I see you there over on the right. Give me a boost. Give me that dolphin boost. Am I even heading north? Yes, okay. Do you even lift, bro? So it, it isn't as easy to tell. Where you're facing, or just stay on the. Oh! That's my orchard. Seemed a lot farther out on the. on the. Seems a lot farther on the drive out than on the drive back, you know what I mean? Mirror, 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 mirror. It's easy to see the direction you go with the map. Oh my lord! Or run into this block just <sighs> what what land is that oh I know where that is okay you haven't tried what uh dolphin boost with ice and elytra is absolutely insane I watched a streamer do it and he did the he did the r2d2 scream nice you haven't tried it. Well, you should try it, Space Pickle, obviously. Oh, Mosher, did you clip the, uh, did you clip Pretzel doing the thing? Is that what that is? No? Okay, hold on. I'll go see it in a second. Bunch of bamboo here, so I have almost a whole double chest of sticks. Nice. All right, let's see what this. No, is that gonna play? Because it opened up a Twitch player. I'm doing things badly. Yeah. Yes. I'm doing the right thing badly. Yep. One hundred percent. So now I need to go back to... The pyramid. And that clip looks like it's from 2013. It's old. I mean, I was on Twitch. I, uh, I had more hair than I do now. And that was at the house in Lansing when Skippy was less old. And then I need to go back to the library to, to install these. I think also I do like that me like coming over here this way activates the chunks <coughs> that has the, um, the, uh, the vines in it that I put in Peter's basement. Every clip was from this when Skippy was less old. That's true because it was before now. So by definition, it has to be from when I was less old. That's how time works, right? The the undeniable and uh, uh, unstoppable uh, forward progression of time. It's true. Inexorable. Thank you, Space Pickle. That is the word I was looking for. Minus the H. Yeah, well, I read right over it. It's fine. So like a smaller infinity? N no. Yes, and he's more old now than he will be in the past that has been. Thanks, Treos. Thanks, Treos. Space Pickle says, I have very good spelling, but I can't speed on this keyboard. Sad. Is it is it the white gaming keyboard? Well, maybe you should uh, get good at your keyboard. <laughs> no. Yeah, low profile. Yep, yeah, no. No, not for me, thanks. 
I got my mechanical. My normal profile mechanical. It's so good. Oh, it is a mechanical. Cheerio back to really nice. <sighs> Which were the ones I got? <sighs> They're the silence. They're the same ones that Tro's jet has. Space pickle, why why did you Okay, this doesn't match anything in this room at all. Why did you use a gold block? Why? Why? It it's nothing matches. Just no. Sir. Golden egg. It's not an egg! It's a cube! Well, we can't be perfect as much. Oh my, oh my god, there's an actual golden apple and a golden carrot in the game! Oh, it leads there, I see. If you're gonna call it the golden egg, I guess. The, no, not the Borg, Treos. That's where we're going to visit on Sunday. Whatever, I can't make you stop your cart on a golden apple. That's true. You could just, you know, not do that at all. Also, there aren't enough signs. Sir. <laughs> You're not going there. That's true. You don't want to be assimilated. Norf isn't my responsibility. You built it! <laughs> now he's judging us both. Treos? Yeah, probably. I did not build that yet. No! Listen, no. You built that rail line, sir, and the ceiling rail. Oh my god. It's awesome. I'm talking, are you saying you didn't put in the gold brick? You didn't put in the gold, the block of gold, space pickle, is that what you're saying? Are you saying that Izzy did it? No, you said there aren't enough sun. Need more coffee soon. I can't remember if I fin finished the pot or not. <sighs> Meatballs will make you feel better. Uh, hanging out with my kids tomorrow will make me feel better. That'll make me feel better. It always does. Even if they're being little jerk face McGillicuddies, it doesn't matter. Hanging out with them always brings me joy. I might actually uh, drag one of my my chairs, my old ass chairs, out onto the porch in the snow tomorrow night and smoke a cigar in the snow when I get back. You'll be with your yours all day too. Nice. Well, I won't be with mine all day unless their school gets canceled. Treos, I know that you think the meatballs are nothing special. You've told me this over and over and over and over and over and over again. But I'm gonna try the meatballs. It's just like when I went to Chicago and tried Malort. It's just the thing that you do. All right, let's see how off I was. One, two, three, four, five. I was off by one, which is the worst computer error to have. They're not some crazy flavor explosion. They're just satisfying and very, very inexpensive. Yeah, that's fine. I'm not looking for... Ikea has cinnamon buns? Oh, I'll have, to, I'll have to get a cinnamon bun then with my meatballs. Yes, Treos, I... <laughs> I understand that you think... <laughs> Tr 
Treos. Treos, my good friend. Treos. Let's have let's have a heart to heart. Let's have a talk. I get it. <laughs> the meatballs are nothing special. I turned off the autofocus and it's still doing it anyway. That thanks thanks camera. And that I should have a cinnamon bun because the cinnamon buns are special. <laughs> But I'm gonna have both. No, he shouldn't have to tell me again, because he tells me every single time we talk about IKEA. But he. <sighs> Quick reminder: exclamation point clip is a thing. <laughs> if that is. Uh, okay, now. We can call the basement 100% finished. Yep, that's been saved, Izzy. I don't know how much of my rant it'll capture, but it'll capture part of it. <laughs> Look at that, that's that dirty orange wood. All right, what time have we got? Oh look, it's about time. Perfection. Ah, <laughs> uh, it's about that time. So I'll give it I'll give it about five more minutes. I start a little bit late. Time for some IKEA cinnamon buns. Sunday Mosier. Sunday I will have to try the cinnamon buns and the meatballs. See Izzy, when you get to having fun, the time just flies by. Because it's Ikea. Listen, if I can handle Malort, I don't think I'll be disappointed with some, you know, good, decent, cheap-ass meatballs. They sell them by the pan, half dozen cinnamon rolls inexpensively. Well, I'll come home with a whole box then. Perfect. Unless, unless you mean that that's we all we have to eat them all in the. Okay, listen, I'm mostly there for furniture. So, oh, you guys are the worst. You guys are the worst. Oh, they do have furniture. Yeah, apparently a giant dimension spanning maze of furniture. I'm, I'm beginning to regret the decision to go to Ikea with you guys. It is a literal maze. I'm a, that's what I've heard, Space Pickle. That's what I've heard. Just be glad Treos isn't going, I guess. Space Pickle, I doubt you're gonna find enough servers there to box me in. <laughs> Don't test you. Uh, I mean, what else do I ever do? I expect to get like all of my steps in that day just by trying to find a way out of the Ikea. No, not challenge except, what? Oh my God. You follow the herd? I don't want there to be enough people for there to be a herd. That's not good. That's why we're going earlier in the morning. <sighs> All right, so that way and that. Yeah, there will be less of a cloud in the early hours. Right, less, right, less hopefully means not a herd. That's my hope. Why do I have a text from Ace Face McGillicuddy? Probably asleep, but I'm gonna text her back anyway. She texted me like when she should have been in bed anyway. There are shortcuts through some areas. 
No, I, uh, Izzy says, no, I haven't seen a herd in a bit at Ikea. Space Pickle says there are shortcuts through some areas, but they're not obvious. Izzy says, but first time through, I moved as we followed people around. That's right, I mean, you, that's what you do, Izzy. That's an Izzy thing to do. Yep. Skipper be skipping. Oh, you have messages. Hold on. Uh, perfect place to be stuck if the weather goes to shit. You're not wrong, but the weather's going to shit tomorrow. There are maps, unlike here. Oh my god. Trader says there'd be less of a crowd in the early hours. Listen, you want me? Let, you want me to pay attention to all of chat? What is? It's like you don't know what stream you're watching, and you're the mod. All right, look. We'll just we'll just stick around here and skippy Norad. Mod squad. That was for fun. What? Oh. Uh, that was uh, surprising. I did not expect to see you here, sir. Oh. Oh, you think so, huh? Enjoy the lava. What the hell is that over there? Oh yeah, I, I've seen that. That's, anywho. You've been watching on glimish.tv slash skipper J where I stream every Tuesday and Thursday around 9 p.m. Eastern and one day on the weekends where there's oftentimes a giveaway. I am planning on streaming early in the afternoon on Saturday. I don't know if everything will come together for that, but that is the current plan. Uh, Treos, I swear to God. One week later, those videos go live on YouTube. At youtube.com slash skip for j where they're grouped by game in the playlist in order chronologically. So you can watch the playthrough from beginning to end, assuming I finished the game and the game can be finished. You also have a great night, Treos. Remember, if you want to support me, <coughs> you can sub here in Glimish, or you can check out my writery goodness over at davidmcrampton.com. My fiction comes in dead tree and electronic format. Or you can check out my webcomic at fofcomic.com. It's got robots. Or you can buy me a coffee at ko.fi.com slash skip for J. Because I love coffee. You've been glimished. Remember, everyone, even when Treos won't shut up about the goddamn meatballs, you're awesome. And you've got this. <laughs>